The number of dead continues to rise from this mass shooting in Las Vegas. TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Mariah Powell spoke with a local law enforcement officer with personal ties to this tragedy. She has more on how law enforcement are working to prepare for possible disasters and what you can do to protect yourself. So it's tragic to hear because uh, being from Vegas, you know that it's just people out there to have a good time. And then you have an incident like this that makes people rethink, really is it safe to go to concerts and venues and, and things like that. MTU Public Safety Lieutenant Reed DeVoe was born and raised in Las Vegas. During his law enforcement career there, he and his fellow responders constantly drilled in preparation for large-scale disasters. With those officers that I work with, I know that they're doing their best and that uh, they're doing everything they can to, to make everyone safe and, and try to prevent the next one. From early reports, it, it seems that um, despite the tragedy that uh, the response is, is going um, uh, rather well. MTU hosts a number of concerts and sporting events with large crowds throughout the year. In light of last night's tragic shooting, preparing for the worst that could happen at these events is at the front of DeVoe's mind. So Michigan Tech's uh, Department of Public Safety and Police Services uh, continuously uh, throughout the year trains with local departments on uh, scenarios. Um, on how to react to scenarios such as active shooters, uh, not just public safety, but all departments at, at Michigan Tech uh, contribute to that culture of safety here and preparedness. First responders' top priorities in a large-scale emergency are assessing ongoing danger, treating victims quickly, and reuniting them with friends and family. You don't have to be a member of law enforcement to prepare yourself for and prevent tragedy. If you know of someone, relative, friend, family member, a coworker, someone that's uh, been acting suspicious lately, you know, always alert the authorities. Uh, a lot of times there's uh, indicators before these events occur. Anyone concerned about attending a large scale event is encouraged to arrive with a fully charged cell phone in order to contact authorities or family members in case of emergency. People are also encouraged to remain vigilant at large crowd type events and to report any suspicious activity. I'm Mariah Powell, TV6 News, Houghton.